Hey, I'm Ryan, and now I'm going to be showing you glitches in the map Machin for Call of Duty World at War for the Wii. I started out by jumping off that building around to that railing, and then just walk up and you're in here. The decent sniping spot, or whatever, you can use basically any gun. I think that a, f a fire, a flamethrower, would be really good here. You can also snipe up there. I was some ha having some trouble turning around to look up there, but there you go. You'll eventually get spotted, though. This next glitch, you can see where I am on the map in that big circle. You climb up onto that, jump up onto the fence here. So you'll get to see it. Jump up onto the fence, climb up, then jump up onto there. Just be careful and walk along it, then watch where my guy shoots. You're gonna sprint and jump. And aim for that corner right there. Sprint and jump. And then you have to walk up and hold to the right, or just go straight. And when you get to the peak, then you can get up actually on the roof. This is a really good spot. You can just lay down. You can snipe people who go in that tower I'm about to look at. Not too much. You're not going to get too many people to come by, though. It's really like it's a good spot, but it's hard to see people from where you're at. You're not going to get too many people sniping with it. And the only way you can get off is the one side that you got on. So you can't like jump off on the other side. And you can't get down there either. Actually, you can. See, but then you can't get off anyway, so it doesn't matter. You'll see me try to jump to this other glitch. Yeah, but I can't because I'm going not going forward at all. <laughs> the only way to get off is that, and I died. Here is the very back of the map. You just Put a satchel down, satchel jump. It's the very last house. You satchel jump onto the roof. That's so. And then you're on. You can go off the map to the, like behind me, but you can't really go anywhere. It's really pointless. If you want to mess around with it, you can, but it's not really a good suggestion. This also is a decent sniping spot, but it is a glitch, so. You'll see me try to jump to that house. Here's another easy glitch, or easy spot to get up to. Climb up onto the fence, jump up onto this pole, and then onto the house. A lot of the glitches in Machin are on the houses, so you don't have to be like in a private match or need flak jacket or any of that. That's the good thing about the glitches in Machin. And you can get under the map without a satchel. And I'm going to be showing you that a little bit later on in the movie. Here I'm going to be getting up onto this house. Into this house. Jump onto the barrels. Of course, you can see where I am on the map. Put the satchel down and then satchel jump backwards or forwards. Now you're in this little house that you couldn't get into before. You can only go behind this wall. You can't go back further. Uh, you'll see me shoot back there, but there's like a, a hidden wall. And you can't go past a certain point. There's a lot you can do up here. You can snipe, and it's, a, it's actually a really good spot. And you can actually do this in a real match if you have a satchel. Like some satchel jump glitches, you need, you can't do it with a flak jacket because it won't let you get air but this one you can do it and so I do it a lot when I come and mock in see there's that invisible wall here is uh, another roof glitch jump up onto that onto the canoe and then you're on to this roof right here nobody really showed me how to do this I've seen people hide up here but I actually had to figure it out for myself but it's not that bad you can crouch down you can lay down but otherwise, you'll probably get like one or two kills and then people will start seeing you and you're basically dead. Here, just jump up onto this railing, 
up onto this railing. You, sh you should know where this place is. Down to there. And then, then get into there. Oh yeah, here's how you get into it. I just wanted to explain it. You just get on that railing, just walk up, and you jump onto there. And you just sprint and jump. Or walk and jump, or just jump. And it's just like the other spot. You can shoot people. It's not that great though. Okay, here's a cool, cool glitch that one of my people in my clan showed me. I just fell trying to do it. It's also in this tower. Jump up on the table, then on that rack. You have to jump to the corner of that window. Right on the corner. It's actually pretty hard to get up here. Like that, then you jump straight out like that and land. Now you're on this roof. You have to stay on the railings though, or else you'll just fall back into the actual building. It's not that bad. It's you'll probably easily be seen if someone's sniping from over there. But it's a glitch and you, if you want to mess around with it, you can do that. Here's another glitch, it's really cool. You can just see where I am. Get up onto these boxes, put the satchel on the box or the barrel, get onto the box, and satchel jump up. I just wanted to jump to make sure I had room. And you're in this roof. This is a really good glitch. I don't I haven't tried it using the slack jacket before, but you might want to try it. This spot is really good. You can shoot out. But people can't see you at all. See, you can see me shooting the ground. And the roof. And all over the map. And sniping. Here, yeah, I'm going to show you how to get onto the other roof that I was just looking at. You have to sprint and jump. And we have to walk right on this line right here. See, if you don't see smoke, that means you'll fall through. So just walk on the line. Then when you get up here, turn to the right and then walk on that post. And then you're on it. This is the building that I was in for another glitch by satchel jumping on the barrels. There you can snipe people who get like to get on that roof, which is like the glitch that everybody in like the whole game knows. You can snipe people in that tower. People coming out of there, people in the circle. Overall, a good spot. You have to do the same thing to get back, too. Walk along the posts. Or if you want to get down, you can just jump. You probably won't die. Then just sprint and jump again. And you'll make it easily. Okay, here, I'm just going to keep going straight for some reason to experiment, and I fall into some dark room, which you can't get out of unless you kill yourself. And there's absolutely no point to it. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty lame. I, I'm trying to get out, but it doesn't work. That's where I just was. I was stuck in there because I went up on that roof. I was just in that roof and I was up there. So that's probably one of the better glitches, but here's a really cool one. You have to get up on that railing up straight ahead. You'll see. If you don't know how to get in that building, just message me. But otherwise, everybody should know how to get up there. You just jump on the railing and then jump up. Now here you just walk off the side and you fall into water. And a lot of people don't know, but you can actually go under the map. You so you go in bounds right up here. Now you'll see that you'll guy will start to like have red around him and get hurt, but it's because he's not able to breathe. I actually had to discover that myself. See how I'm starting to hurt? We just got to stop swimming and let your guy float up. See? And here you can't shoot. But you can go around and knife people. It's not a very good glitch at all, but adventure. If you have any questions or comments or suggest for other videos, just leave a message or a comment. Thanks for watching.